Hey guys, Dan Carr here. Uh, today we're going to take a quick look at another product from my gear cupboard. And this is the Secudo Studio base plate for C300 uh, Red Epic or Red Scarlet. You can buy it without this rod riser on the front. You only need this if you're having it on an Epic or a Scarlet. Without this, just as the Studio base plate for the Canon C300 or C500, it's $400. With the rod riser on the front for the red cameras, it's $465. And it's just a nice way to get uh, 15 millimeter lightweight rods on the front of your camera but we also have these uh, slots on the side uh, sorry the back as well um, so we can add rear rods to any of those cameras as well uh, for extra slots in each corner as well so if you're having you can have another rod set up uh, coming out of the side to attach uh, monitor evf or something like that so it's quite an expensive uh, solution, as all Secudo equipment tends to be, but uh, it does serve a pretty good purpose. Um, in terms of attaching it to your tripod head, we've got this sliding uh, T-stop on the bottom here as well, so you can really dial in the balance of your system. Um, just if you wanted to remove these front rods, then um, it's just a couple of quick screws on there, and you can also adjust the height to get things lined up uh, perfectly with your matte box and or get your follow focus to engage uh, just how you want it to so um, it's it's pretty heavy heavy duty you know if you were going for a shoulder rig or a handheld setup then um, you wanted to stick with Zakudo gear then definitely check out their C300 or Epic Scarlet Gorilla Plate they call it it's a much lighter weight version than this this is really designed to be uh, on a set of sticks but um, you know, it's built built nicely, uh, as Zakudo stuff tends to be. Uh, pretty chunky, uh, pretty high priced, uh, as I said, but um, there's not a huge number of easy options out there for getting front and rear rods off the RED cameras. So this is actually a nice solution for doing that. Uh, if you were just using this on the C300 without these rod risers on the front, yeah, maybe uh, in that case, I would look at some uh, some solutions maybe from Red Rock Micro which are still really good but a little bit less money but uh, nonetheless there'll be some more photos of this and a review on my website coming soon.